how to use wix editor x hi guys welcome back today i'm going to be showing you how you can use wix editor x to create a professional advanced website on wix so let's get started first what you have to do is you will simply go to wix.com sign up or sign in to your dashboard or wix this is my dashboard for wix and today i am going to be creating a website using editor x on wix we get two editors and we get a wix classic and editor x so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go ahead and click on create new site when you click on create new site you have to select editor x instead of classic wix once you do that then you can simply select from all of the different templates available and it is editor x right here i will show you how to create a website using editor x now we are inside our editor x you can see right here the outlook of editor x is a bit different from our classic wix editor and then all of the features are the tools and features are more advanced and we can actually you know change the alignment of the page we get a preview so working in editor x is actually really good and it helps you create a website that is very professional now let me show you around in editor x we find this plus button that allows us to add different elements and from here we will be able to add our elements such as title paragraphs buttons images media decoratives menu search block store and more it's a simple drag and drop then we have this option right here which is layers so we can work in layers on editor x a page can have more than one layer and we can add sections in layers as well so this is pretty unique uh, we don't see this kind of layouts like a layer layout in editing websites but in editor x we're getting this so that we can create very professional um, websites and it's really good for web designers then we have master option so master is like adding your headers apps and footers in here we will be able to add master sections that can show multiple pages and we will be able to change them then we have of course pages where you will be able to add all the pages to your website then we have site styles and in here we will be able to change the text the you know different alignment and style then we have app market from where we can add different apps such as a comment section maybe if you want to add a store whatever you want to add you can add from here and then we have a content manager and in here you will be able to set up a content collection you can create hundreds of dynamic pages and build a custom form so this is like the basic view this is going to be the preview this is the width right now and this is our template right here that i have selected you can see right here we can move down this is the template that i have selected right now it has a built-in store within a website and in wix editor we can not only you know add sections vertically but we can also add sections horizontally so now let me actually show you how to add different elements the first thing that i'm going to do is i'm going to change the text so i have deleted that text now i'm going to go to elements i will go to title drag it and drop it right here and you can see added title section is added i will simply click right here on added text and now i will be able to change the text i can now change the size the font everything about this text so this is our title right here you can simply go ahead and you know customize it added the text added the size everything so i'm going to go ahead and change the size to maybe 45 click enter and the size will be increased so this is how you change a text now we have this image right here i don't want this image so i want to delete this section i will simply click right here and then i have change image option i have move crop and add a comment but i will click on these three dots right here and it will allow me to delete this section from here in here we have other options as well such as arrange rotate align anchor place in a container don't display and delete so i'm going to go ahead and click on delete and this section will be deleted you can see right here now we have this image right here and let's say that i want to change this image what i will do is i can simply click on the image 
and then I can actually make it smaller if I want to, um, you know, change the image, edit the image, I can do so. Then we have products right here, product images. Of course, we will change all of the images within our website. Let me show you how you add a different elements to your website. So when we hover over, we get this plus button and or we can simply go to elements and drag and drop different sections. Let's say that I want to add a button. So you will simply drag it and drop it where you want to add the button to. We can add different sections, different elements right here and we can divide a section into different elements too. So working with Editor X is really easy but you have to keep track what you're adding and you can add anything anywhere on your website. So this is the text and this is a paragraph text right here. If I want to change the text of the button, of course, we will click right here, add a link. I'm already saying that how to add a link. You should know that if you already use a Wix, then it will be really easy for you to understand Editor X. But uh, I'm actually trying to explain everything very simply so that you will have an idea how to simply use an Editor X even as a beginner. You will simply add your link from here. Then I can again go to elements. I can add a line. Simply select the line, drag, drop where you want it to add and a line will be added. So this is how you simply add different elements with simple drag and drop. Let me show you how to change an image or a video. Let's say that I want to change this image right here. Simply click on the image, right click and you can actually select the layer for your image as well. So right now if I go to select the layer and section, then I will be able to actually customize its section. I can add a text above this layer. To change an image, you simply click right here and then we get the option of change image. With change image, of course, we can upload media from our computer or select from Wix. I'm going to select this image right here and you can see a new image is added. So we have our site title. Of course, you will change the font and size and then we have our image. Similarly, we can change headers, footers, add stores, add different products for our store images and more. If I go to pages right here, then I will be able to add a new page from this option. To delete a page, you select on these three options. We can also go work on the SEO basics and basic share, rename, duplicate, edit a page or delete. I will simply click on delete and this page will be deleted. To go to a new page, you can simply select the page. And then you can click on edit page and it will take you to that page and you will be able to edit it the way you want to. We can also go ahead and change the design for our website with dial site style. And then we have different apps from where I can simply go ahead and add different apps to my website right here. Once your site is done, you can get a preview from here. And you can also invite people to your website right here or you can publish it right now. This way you will be able to create a professional website using Wix Editor X. I wanted to give you an overview about Wix Editor and I hope that I was a big help to you. And now Wix Editor is not alien to you. You know how to use it. It's super simple and super easy and it will help you create your own advanced websites. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the YouTube channel.